Hello, my lovelies. Welcome to Painting with Whiskey and Women. It's Krista and Christina. Um, give a big shout out to Jill. She is uh, not feeling real well tonight. So she is taking the night off to get some respite and some Tylenol and stuff in her. And hopefully she'll be feeling well. So let me just get this out of the way. Jill is with Not Too Shabby at Olivia and Company <laughs> on the Road, located in Albany, Georgia. She is a premier elite retailer. That means you can find all of Dixie Bell and Silk right there. Also, she does custom and she has her painted booth inside Livy and Company. Christina and I have both been to Livy and Company. And let me tell you, it is beyond taboo. Love that place. You can pick up anything for anybody. If you need a last minute gift, girl, you're there. And they had a lot of cool stuff when we went in there yesterday. I was like, did y'all get new vendors? Because y'all got some good stuff going on. Yeah. So, Christina, tell them what you about, girl. Well, first off, I'm about, um, I didn't turn my computer on like I said I was. <laughs> so, I'm trying to share my stuff. Um, Bill, if you're watching this and you're here, you could share for me. If not, I'll get to it in a minute. Um, but I am Christina, a.k.a. Bug. I'm an elite Dixie Bell retailer. Um, I have a booth at 1427 Rosal Road at the Marietta Antique Mall in Marietta, Georgia. That's where you find all of my Dixie Bell stuff and some of my painted furniture. I also have another location here in Holly Springs, um, not too far from me. And um, that is where you find um, my painted things as well. And tonight, I don't know what I'm doing because I was traveling. I think I'm going to work on another canvas like Jill and I were doing yesterday. So I think that's what I'll do. So and we were it. actually supposed to be doing Flamingo tonight, but Jill's not with us. And since it was either Jill or Bug, I can't remember which one, uh, but they yeah, were they both, both all about us. it. I'm yeah, still and about so, it. Still kidding, you know, we don't want her to miss out on the fun. <laughs> yeah, since it was one of y'all's ideas. Uh, yeah, I ain't doing it I got mine right here. Well, I, I got my piece ready and stuff, but I, you know, it was Jill's idea or your idea. So I'm making y'all do it. Okay. Let me get so Dana Perry Ridge is on. She says, hey, y'all. So I am hey. Crystal with Litter to Go ahead. You can say hi. Hi. Was that me? I didn't. Hi. My thing was breaking. Oh. Uh, I am Krista with Litter to Glitter. I am, uh, you can find us inside of Plaza Garland Suite N108. That's where I have all my Dixie Bell ooey gooey goodness. I do all my customs out of there. I also have a painted piece. You can get all those inside of the, I almost said Marietta Antique Mall, inside of the Mesquite Antique <laughs> Mall uh, in Mesquite, Texas. And so. Uh, here we're working on my military tonight on the Dixie Bell main page. I have decided that on each side of this stencil, on this side, it's going to say all gave some, and on this side, some gave all. But I haven't decided which letter I'm going to use. So uh, let me. So if you see those letters Krista. there or these letters, yes, ma'am. I'm going to give you a warning. I'm about to yes, plug uh, in my live connection because it's acting crazy. I'm about to put plug in my cord. So if it does something weird, I'll come right back in. Okay. Because it's there's like okay, a delay awesome. or something. You might have to go out and come back in. So I'm going to plug it in if it drains. Okay. It's plugged in. Da, 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 da. And she's still here. Okay, sure. sweet. Uh, Dana says, Dana Reg says, oh, dang, I meant to go back and share a copy of that flamingo door I spoke of last week. Uh, Twine oh, yeah. is on. She says, hello, lady. Sue hey, Owens you. is on. Pat Patricia's on from New Jersey. Uh, hey, Bridget Smith, she says she likes the white stencils. So we got to vote for the white. So, uh, like I said, Tell me what you think about the stenciling for the letters on the top. Shorty says he likes the white. I like the white. Stacy's on YouTube. Oh, she's switching it up. She's on YouTube. Okay, well then let me get rid of the <laughs> green ones. And I will be working with the white. So that's what we're going to be doing. 
And these are peel and sticks that you just get from your local craft store. Huh? Gina said white. Yep. See, I know Gina said white. So, hmm. make sure I eek. And I know that I'm going to be working upside down for you guys, but I didn't know how else to get the, uh, the uh, camera so you could see what I was doing. Because if I did it the other way, y'all would be looking over my back. <laughs> Okay, here we go. And of course, whiskey's down there chewing on something. Shorty just, or Austin just saw. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, it's one of those, you know, put the, move the camera over just a little bit so y'all can see. Okay, let's see. You know what? I think I'm just going to start out the gate with spatulas. I'm not going to paint a base layer. Okay, because I don't have time. And I need to stir stuff. Somebody yelling at me? I'm not really sure. Uh, I'm not sure. I heard voices upstairs. I don't know if they're talking to Piper or Ainley. Voices. You're hearing voices. <laughs> yeah, I think they're getting ready to go meet for that dinner I was telling you about. Yeah. They got a text saying be there at 730 now, so... Um, they might be getting ready to head out. I think that's what's happening. Gotcha. He did might. He Sarah? might yell. I did. He was making labels for the new stuff that came in, and since gotcha. he looked kind of intense, I was like, you know what? I just go ahead. Don't mind me. I was never here. So Dana, do you? Dana says I thought you were going to use some sort of military icky stencils. Yes, those are smaller. And they're not going to be big enough to use on this top. They are smaller and they will be used on the drawer. But what I'm doing right now is too big of an area. You see how big these are? Those military stencils are about one inch. I mean, so they're only this big in comparison. They're probably about a third of the size of these letters. So that's why I dove into my stencil collection and this is how i keep my lettering stencils to give you guys a tip yeah it's an accordion folder and so i've got it labeled shapes oh, medium shoot. regular letters and numbers small and large script large script large regular letters uh small black block letters large and small cat letters tiny letters script letters more shapes small brass stencils, and then in the very back, I keep the sheets that have this kind of stuff in it. And that's all. So, yeah, the military stencils are about this size. So they're not going to be good for the top. So that's why I'm diving into other stencils for the top. Ooh. Oh. Oh, you girl. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I got my spatulas. <laughs> and boy, I was like, oh, I wasn't going to paint a base layer. No, that spatula just pretty much painted a base layer. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. Carrie's the one. Hey, Carrie. She said, hey, Krista and Christina. Hey, Carrie. Um, and then um, Dana says, okay, gotcha, responding to what I said about the military stencils. And so since these are the stick stencils, I'm just trying to make sure that they're down before I put my glaze. What? Huh? What? What? Huh? Something was in my shoe. I was like, what is that? It was a piece of broken chalk. It's your <laughs> foot. Hopefully no. your foot is in your shoe. No, it was my chalk getting in my shoe because I stepped on a piece of chalk before I went out of town and didn't pick it up. So. Oh, somebody asked how I store my large stencils. My large stencils are up at the shop, and I hang them from a uh, a clip. There's a row of clips um, on a, like a little beam, and I just hang them individually down that, and I hang it up on the wall. So that's hang, where my big stencils. I have pegboard that I hang mine on. You can also do, um, I've seen people do like poles where they get 
like the clothing hangers with the little alligator mm -hmm. clips. You can hang them, you know, get your plastic hangers with your alligator clips and hang them where they, yeah. you know, the, just like you would your very, stuff in your closet. That's very yeah. similar to yep. what um, that clip is that I have. It is like uh, we can use the hangers that have the alligator clip. Yep. Um, I'm glad I'm not the only one that has a stencil collection. <laughs> So oh, this is only one. I've got like three other man. things, and I've got baskets full of them. Yeah, and, I've got so many, yeah. and then I cut my um, own too. So, <laughs> Jeez. yeah. Also, uh, Christine, I don't know if you know or not, but in my store, I have a stencil lending library, and what that yeah, I is, think, yeah, is that, you've talked about that. Yeah. So what I do is that I have a stencil lending library in my store. And any artist that comes in, say if the stencil costs me $15, then you leave me $15. You take the stencil. When you bring me back my stencil and it's clean and not bent, the dog didn't chew it up. I didn't nice. Okay. So I didn't I know that's how it works. Ha ha. Yep. So I need to get a different brush because that brush is just not playing well with others. But that's okay. I've got more. What color am I using? I have no idea, oh. woman. Oh, I know what color I'm using, and I'm going, hmm. Let me try one of these. All righty, then. And then I'll grab one of these, and I'll grab that one. I don't... So, yeah, that's... I don't... This is very, like, skin nude color. Like, I'm looking at it going, it looks like pantyhose. What color is that? Is that the latte? Uh-huh. Maybe it'll dry a little darker? Hmm. All right. I guess we'll see. And so, yeah, I'm moving to this foam brush now because mm. that other brush, since these are stick on stencils, it's thicker. And that natural brush, stencil brush, that you want to get down into the side. Bad. Bad. But that's okay. <laughs> I'm more determined that it is, so. Yeah, that's funny because uh, Shorty just told Whiskey to lay down, and I'm like, no, she has been in like murder play mode all day. <laughs> oh my gosh, <laughs> she has been. I kid you not. That's so funny. <laughs> yeah, she just she has just been like <laughs> ravenous in play mode that's today. Funny. I mean, it is. No, it's not. It is just, I mean. <laughs> no, it's not, she said. No, it's not. It's not. Funny. Have you ever seen a dog, like, run along the side of the walls and the, along the back of the sofa? Not the front of the sofa. Not, <laughs> on, you know, I'm talking about, yeah, she has been, like, literally, like, doing laps around the living room on the side of the furniture. Like, really? the back really? of the, Yeah. She's been cray cray. So what's gotten into her? Like what? I, I don't know. I think Shorty gave her crack before he left the house this morning or something. <laughs> her, her her morning crack <laughs> dosage. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I, well, actually, it started at three o'clock this morning. Um, Austin, I thought that Austin was going to take whiskey to bed with her with him last night. Mm -hmm. And so when Shorty and I went to bed, we left her in the living room. And um, Austin, I guess she curled up into her blanket. And Austin didn't see her, so Austin went to bed. So at 3 o'clock this morning, I thought somebody was breaking into the house. So I got up at 3 o'clock this morning thinking somebody's breaking into the house. And it was Whiskey knocking up against our door trying to get in. Trying to get in. Oh. Yeah. And so, yeah, it's been going. This has been going on since 3 this morning. No, you can't hang her from the ceiling fan. Stop it. <laughs> no. That would not be smart. It would be fun. No, it would not be fun. Okay, stop it. I'm going to get PETA called on us. Oh. Sarah McLaughlin is McLaughlin. going to show up at our front door. It's gonna be That's horrible. what we do. They <laughs> That's what we do with Piper when she gets upset with something. I start singing the Sarah McLaughlin, you know, the arms of an angel. And we uh -huh. start with our ASPCA commercial ad while she just sits there and looks at it. It's like, I'm calling Sarah McLaughlin. I got her on speed dial, y'all. Yeah. You're mistreating me. You won't give me a treat. I, I swear they're like, they're little humans. I swear. They, oh, they I, are. I, I, 
she was so excited when I walked in the door, man. She heard me when I got home, and she about tried to take me out. She was so excited to see me. Well, I remember when we came back from Jill's. Oh, yeah. She was excited. Oh, man. She almost took my legs out from underneath of me. She was like, Whoa. <laughs> And I, yeah. you remember I had to get that on the, I had to literally get that on the ground with her. Yeah. Because if not, she was going to take me over. There it is. So I am leaving these stencils on just a little bit longer because I, as they're drying, I'm adding more okay. in. I'll I don't you. want to. Sorry. They're leaving. Sorry. Uh, tell me. I was like, what are you texting me for? Sorry. <laughs> We're live. Why are you texting me? <laughs> Damn, what's the big secret? Text on whether or not I'm going for sushi. Oh, sushi. They're not starting until 7.30, so I may be able to get over there. We'll see. So, Eva Girl is the one. Eva Girl. Um, Texture is different on the... What the heck am I doing, y'all? Yeah, this Tony is says she's got the zoomies. Yeah, she's got a serious case of the zoomies. I mean, serious, <laughs> serious case of zoomies. I mean, she is just, she's killing me today. You know what? We're going to turn her around. If I sling paint on her, I will lose it. You just have to give her a bath. No, no. I'm talking about my canvas. My oh, angel. your angel canvas? No, I'll lose it. I just realized, I'm like, that's probably, because once I start adding water to the sucker, <laughs> yeah, I'm going to be in trouble. Oh, yeah, it's going to be all man. Yeah, like I will cry on camera. Because that's the first one I'm actually pleased with. And Jill, I didn't post pictures of hers. She was having so much fun. And that, I mean, that canvas is huge. And it looks so cool. I think she's going to go over and redo it. Because she was just kind of trying uh -huh. to figure it out. But yeah, it's really freaking cool. The texture she got on her, she used sea spray on it. And um, she was like a little kid. Every time she'd sweat, she'd be like, oh. the <laughs> It was so awesome to watch her. I, I, just, yeah. I felt like I didn't get much done because I was too busy watching her and laughing at her. She you was know, so that's cute. one of the things I love about when we do classes is that you get to see other people having fun the same way we have fun. Yeah, yeah. So she got it all done. Now, whether or not she goes back and changes it, that's the question now. We'll see what yeah. she does. If she changes it. Oh, that's pretty mixed. Hmm. Interesting. So I know you started doing um, classes. Yeah, I need. To, I only did that one because things got so crazy. I haven't got another one booked, but I need to get because people are asking. And I've got to get some on the books. It's just we were traveling. Yeah, I knew this trip was coming up. Mm -hmm. um, and it's just trying to get everything lined up. So hopefully things are going to settle down in October because <laughs> school. Yeah, right? I know. That's <laughs> right? <laughs> settle down. Oh. What is that? Oh. <laughs> right? Okay, a lot. <laughs> yeah. Maybe not. Maybe not. Yeah, you, you know you're an adult when you say that because you just say that every week and nothing ever slows down. And hope, no, it, it gets faster. Right. This is true. Oh, it, it it'll calm faster. down next week. Oh, it'll calm down next week. Oh, it'll calm down it'll next week. It'll calm down week. when I'm dead. Oh, wait, no, it won't. <laughs> no, I'm still going. Yeah, no. Yeah, no, it's crazy. It's just been and so yeah. crazy. So what color are you doing now? So you started the latte. What is that? Now? I did I did latte and then I put juniper on it. Uh huh. And now I've got coffee bean. I'm just kind of dragging. I swear this canvas feels so different than yesterday. I don't know what it is. It's the same canvas that I was doing. Same kind. Uh, just let's see here. Uh, Tammy girl says she's late, but she made it. Christina. Hey, Tammy. Eva girl said, Christina, I think these canvases should be a class idea. Yeah, that's what we were talking about. Yeah. Somebody else, I think it was Colleen, um, messaged me and, or commented and said it would be so cool. Like, I haven't done many angels. I really feel like I need to get a better, 
like feel on them, but we could totally do it. But the the spatula clasp canvas thing is like totally easy. That's like yeah. so easy to do. And so yeah, so we'll do, do that. You have, do you have your computer pulled up so you can see comments? Um, I do. Okay, well then you need to go look at um uh, well, Bridges' we'll comment because I ain't reading that because you'll kill me. Oh, oh God! Let me go to your page because I can't see it here. Um, uh -oh. I, I just I, I don't even want to be a part of that. Oh God! I'm just gonna sit here and be a good girl because I didn't do it. Hold on! Oh, girl! <laughs> Did you? Oh, I totally forgot about that. Oh, I love you. That's hilarious. I love you. Yeah, I, I ain't even getting into that one. Yep, <laughs> not me, baby. I totally nope. forgot. I see. I I see what you did there. Now I see. I see where you. Yeah, I see what you did there. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and I, I don't want any part of it. And we're not going to bring any. Like no. <laughs> Watch, everybody's like scrolling, looking at the comments, like, Ooh, what Ooh. did she say? What did she say? <laughs> and they're about to light up. <laughs> oh, crap. Yeah. Dang it. Way and so, the re one of the reasons I'm stippling on this glaze is that I don't want it perfect and beautiful. I want it kind of aged and worn. And so, that's why I'm using. And stippling it on instead of getting a nice clean coat. I don't want a nice clean coat. I want it darker in some areas and lighter than others. Hmm. So, uh, yeah, Bridget said it was for fun. I know, but still, ooh. <laughs> Gina said that was funny. It was funny. I just didn't want any part of it. I was, mm -mm. No. One? I just saw the one that Bridget said. Was there more than one? No, no. Okay, I was like, did I miss? Because I just saw that one. So I'm going to move my E down. Oh, no wonder. It's not showing me the old comments. It's just starting up for. Oh, because, yeah, because you just hopped on that page. Yeah, because I couldn't see comments where it was pulled up on mine. I had to go into yours. Yeah. yeah. That's so funny. So I'm, I'm just tapping that down. C thread. Okay. What's that? Huh? Oh, Dana says I had to step away. What did you miss? Uh, <laughs> you missed Christina um, getting her feelings hurt. No, I loved it. It was good. Was good. But I just didn't. Good. I know. It was unexpected because I honestly had totally, I'm like, what? What? Oh, <laughs> wait. Now I see. I see what you did there. I see. Yeah. I, see I, got, I, see what you I did got your there. number, girl. <laughs> I hope not because you're going to call and yell at her. I <laughs> know. I would never. Liar. No. No. I'll yell at the, I'll, I'll, I'll yell at you. I'll yell at Jill. I'll yell at Bill. I won't yell at anybody else. <laughs> And I won't even yell at you and Jill. <laughs> Liar. That leaves one. Because <laughs> he Liar. started it. Liar. Oh, I won't yell at you and Jill. Whatever. You think I would yell at you? You I have yelled at me. You. I have? Well, maybe. What about when we got off of Whiskey and Women last week? <laughs> and I Austin remember. A little trip. <laughs> Wait a minute. So now I'm trying to remember. What happened? When we were discussing things and then he cut the feed and I thought that you both had clicked off <laughs> and I said something and then you're like, oh. Uh, because you were like, you thought that we like pitched you Wait. on the stream, but it was your you son who did it. Pleasure. And you you came back all like, what? Like, what? Can they like do that? Really? And we're like, we're sitting here the whole time watching it. You're the one that got upset thinking and that And then you like, yelled at me when you came back on. I didn't yell. I did not yell. <laughs> yeah, that was, did you hear what Shorty said? Oh, no. Shorty what he said? He said that was uh, Tina that yelled at me, not Christina. Know, it was my alter ego. <laughs> It was Tina. Oh, I said it. Yeah. I said it. I just gave life to her. She's yeah. back. Okay, what we got? 
Okay, that's it. Tina's going to be my alter ego on here. Y'all need to give her a persona. <laughs> you Come on now. Hug, honey. You're getting her in, in trouble. I said that out of love. So she, she wouldn't get blamed. Yeah. Those are older, so. Yeah, Shorty says he said that out of love so you wouldn't get blamed. But Oh, okay. I thank you, Shorty. <laughs> yeah, I'll pass it's that along okay. later. It's okay. It's funny. So somebody asked what I'm working on. Who asked that? Uh, Amanda asked what I'm working on. And what I am working on, this is my military-inspired piece. And on the top, it's going to say, all gave some, some gave all. And it's in glaze and then in glaze here in the middle. And I'll flip the camera around towards the end so you guys can see. This is the only way that I could kind of work on it um, tonight that you guys could see without, like, my shoulder and stuff being in the way. Move it here in just a minute. Ooh, shoot. Oh, mama, you froze on screen. Did I freeze? Yeah, you're froze. Am I still you frozen? Froze. Yeah. But your Isn't arms it? look at mighty dang tone, Is girl. Christina frozen? Yeah. Okay, am I back? I just heard Christina. Your you're slow motion. Okay, I'm back. Uh, okay, I'm kind of back. You're, yeah, slow motion. You're jumping. There you are. There you are. Okay. So what I was saying is that I'm working on my military inspired piece um, and I'll move the camera here in just a minute so y'all can see it from the correct perspective but this is the only way I could work on it without you guys seeing my back all day you know throughout the whole video so I'm just moving my stencils around and so uh, whiskey and now whiskey's wrestling with ball or with uh, Austin. It's like, good lord, she just will not stop tonight. She's okay. Which one of y'all changed her energizer bunny? <laughs> I mean, somebody energized her or something because she is all about it tonight. Somebody gave her new batteries. Yeah. Probably she brought Piper to... down here. She's Man. up there all alone. So, um, Christina, or, hey, Tina, um, Bridget once said, how about pouncing with a dry paper towel on the canvas to add texture? That's funny. That's what I was just doing. That's hilarious. I literally just started doing that, and I heard, hey, Tina. <laughs> hey, Tina. <laughs> Come get your dinner. Oh, yeah, Shorty's trying to blame Whiskey's uh, actions on me tonight because I gave her a uh, chicken noodle soup. <laughs> chicken noodle <laughs> soup made your dog go spastic? I don't know. She likes that stuff, man. Man, I ain't some chicken noodle soup. I want to take a nap. That's like comfort food. Like, yeah. Like... Well, apparently it has crack in it for <laughs> when it comes to Whiskey. <laughs> Cracking noodle soup. <laughs> so Eva asked what kind of brush I'm using. Eva girl, this is just an inexpensive sponge brush that you can get like 50 of them in a pack for less than $5 at Walmart craft store. Um, because these are sticky stencils, they're thicker. And so when I was using a good stencil brush a second ago, it the stencil the natural chip bristles weren't going down into the edges and so it wasn't looking right and so i switched over to an inexpensive brush and boom boom baby <laughs> it worked so there you go and then I'll move. This. No, you got her to temporarily calm down. You didn't get her to calm down. So, uh, 
move the camera over to this side so y'all can see what I'm doing. Smelly vinegar. Oh my gosh. Oh, are you, did you spray it with vinegar to get it to drip? Yeah. It's like, whoo, it is strong. Potent. Carrie said she was on the phone ordering a screen replacement for her husband's phone. Mm -hmm. um, again, this is my military inspiration piece. Uh, Bridget said it's all Bill's fault. <laughs> Jackie, it is. Jackie Garrett's on with this. Hey, girl. Hey, Jackie. Um, he's, he's not here to defend himself. So <laughs> Even better. Even better. <laughs> so Sometimes we don't need him to defend himself. We just need him to hush. <laughs> Don't tell him I said that. Oh, the the video footage is right there, girl. Like he can't. Yeah, like that. he goes back and watches later. You, you never you don't know. Say, don't say nothing. Won't be nothing. That's the way I look at it. Don't say nothing. Won't be nothing. <laughs> Niches get here. stitches. <laughs> Niches get stitches. Listen to me. As my daughter says, "Mom ain't raised a snitch." You see Ainsley saying that because she legit told somebody that. Yeah, but she's, gosh, she's so tiny. <laughs> Anne's on YouTube. Hey, so Anne. Anne. Yeah, Anne's on YouTube. So, Anne, when do you get out of Facebook jail, girl? Anne? Anne from Indiana? Yeah, Anne from Indiana. She's in Facebook jail. What does she do? Um, I get so she, surprised. When people get in, like, like they committed a crime or something. Yeah. And the thing is, is that if you, if you express an honest opinion, they put you in jail. Yeah. And that's what she did. She gave a very honest opinion. Oh, yeah, you can't have opinions. That's right. Well, that's you know. Right. Not, in their, not unless they're Facebook approved opinions. Hey, yeah. Yeah. And Shorty wants to know if we need to go by the jail and put some money on your commissary. <laughs> she says she doesn't get out of Facebook jail till October. Are you serious? Yeah, I think they gave her a 30-day ban. What the heck, man? See, well, she's a, repeat of, she's a repeat oh. offender. Is she really? See, I've never yeah. been. I stay quiet. I don't comment on anybody's stuff. <laughs> And then now, thanks to the whole business page switch around, it's too hard to like go back and forth on my page. So all my friends that I've missed your birthdays over the last month, I am so sorry, but you have no idea what a pain in the, you know what it is to try to toggle back and forth because it won't let me. And then it tells me you're not authorized. I'm like, okay, screw you. Fine. Sorry. You're not getting a birthday today. Screw you, Facebook. Not like, you know, my friends. I'm sorry. Happy birthday. Uh -huh. But um, <laughs> you know what I mean? You heard it here, you heard it here folks. You heard it here first. <laughs> Although I might get Facebook jail for saying screw you, Facebook. So <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. No, I've been a good yeah. girl. Uh, so Dana Red said, Christina, do you have any family in Texas? Don't think ever that I ever mentioned that I'm also a Chapman. Oh, I do have family. My sister's there, but um, are you a Chapman by blood or by marriage? Well, no, never mind. You're um, never mind. That was the dumbest question I could have just asked. You have to be. I don't have any like my sister's in Texas, but. Um, you know, she's my sister and she's not right. Chapman so anymore. You don't have older family that. No, you know. no, I have some out in California. Um, but the majority of my family's here in Georgia, the, the Chapman side, Georgia and Florida, because mm -hmm. half of them came from Florida. I mean, my dad was born in Florida, so, um, is Dana Files on? Hey, yeah, they're on hey, vacation. Dana. Yeah, Dana oh, and yeah. Peter are on vacation, and they're finally getting some quality together time, and I hope that they're enjoying it. Oh. Where'd y'all go? Where'd y'all get to go to? I think they went to Colorado. Oh, cool. If memory, memory serves me correct. I think they flew to Colorado. That's cool. And Dana Shorty just uh, drink one for him. <laughs> I 
They're so, on the road watching. Oh, they're on the road watching us. Oh, really? So, yeah, they were supposed, yeah, they were supposed to, I think, fly in. Um, I think it's Colorado. And then they were going to be going to all these different sites all around Colorado. And, you know, Shorty and I just did that. And it's a great thing. It, it's. I hope that you're relaxing and recovering your soul and getting back to what's important. And Keith? Don't dump her off on the side of the highway. She says something. Call me. I'll get her home. <laughs> you know I love you, girl. Yeah. I just need my heat dryer, man. No, don't do your heat dryer. If you do, let us know. We'll turn your mic off. No, I'm not. I don't have it. On. I, oh, that's good. I heard that. That works. I heard that. Who? Christina, you said that. Did I did I did I miss Christina making a face at me? Yes. Oh, Austin just told on you, Christina. Yeah, because you said he would talk about me whenever I get muted. Is yeah. That what you said? Well, I, I can hear yeah, you. I don't, have, I don't have to wait for you to get muted. I can talk about you now. If I'm muted, I can hear you. You just can't hear me talking about you. <laughs> Telling you how much I love you, Krista. Love you, girl. You know I it's funny you. because Patience. yeah, Son of a, keep I'm it about, up. I'm about to cuss. You know, I right. have been asked if we're actually friends in real life or whatever, and I'm like, Are you uh, yeah, yeah. Why would people ask that? Yeah, I have. I've had at people actually ask if we're friends in real life. I'm like, yeah, I stayed at her house for, you know, a week. <laughs> what kind of question is that? That's kind of funny. That's so funny. Oh, Shorty, Shorty just said he has to pay Christina to be my friend. <laughs> Shorty, you weren't supposed to tell anybody that. <laughs> yeah. That was Christina our Christina said Shorty you weren't supposed to tell anybody that. <laughs> no, but see, I'm the friend that lets her do oh, no, you're, stupid oh, wait stuff, like go into a liquor store corn fart. Yeah, and go around the entire town looking for a Taco Bell. <laughs> Shorty, you going to die. That was that was more than one town. That was like <laughs> interstate <laughs> link. Yeah, that was interstate <laughs> that we did that, and there was like more than one town. But every exit. Uh, I was it I we were in 85 or yeah. 75 185 and 85 yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. what they did. And it was like every exit said Taco Bell. Every exit had one of those, you know, this exit, you know, McDonald's, Burger King, you know, whatever. And they every lied. exit <laughs> did not have one. We they actually lied. ended up stopping at the Harley dealership. And ask them, where's the closest Taco Bell? Because, yeah. I mean, we went to, like, what, four or five different exits. Oh my and God. every one of them. And there was a sign. You're like, Taco Bell this Taco way, Bell quarter this mile. Way. Like, Taco Bell this way, half no. mile. Yeah. And no. nope. Nope. Didn't it change the highway to uh, Hangry Highway? Yeah, now it's called Hangry Hangry Highway. <laughs> uh, and, uh, Tell you what. Jill is, uh, somebody just asked, Ann asked where Jill was. Jill is not feeling real well tonight. Yeah. And as you know, we were going to all paint with Flamingo tonight. But since Jill is not feeling well, we're going to be doing that next week. <laughs> Shut up, Shorty. You're not supposed to say that. What did he say? He says, well, my wife really didn't want to paint with Flamingo. So she I know she didn't. Jill. She <laughs> She's been fighting Flamingo the whole time. I'm like, oh, you scared? <laughs> we'll we'll do it this week without Jill. We'll paint this week without Jill, and then I'll paint again. Like, I was going to, but I didn't. I and I got I'm like, uh-uh, I ain't painting with Flamingo two weeks in a row. I got other videos to do, and I prep stuff, and I'm working on stuff, and you ain't taking up two of my Tuesday nights with <laughs> Flamingo. <laughs> Uh uh, I got stuff to do. Yeah, it's killing me not to work on my piece. Um, but since I've been gone, the piece I started on the main page, what two Fridays ago, I'm uh -huh. trying not to touch it so I can continue with the transfers on it. Um, yeah, so I guess I'm saving it for Friday, and I'll just try to get it done. 
And see, I'll be and, starting a new piece because I've done all I can with this yeah. on um, Dixie Bell's page. So I've got to get this finished up, not on Dixie Bell's page. Right. So um, I think we so get I'll there, be starting off a new project. So if there's something that you guys want to see or want more information about, you like a product used, let me know. And I, boy, Shorty, you need to hush, boy. What's he doing now? He says, I'd like to see a vacuum used on your car. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, he's so funny. So Amber asked, are you done with your canvas? Which one? Which one? She wants to know which, yeah. I'm not sure because I know you did your angel. You've got several canvases you've done recently. Yeah, so I didn't keep working. I'll show you guys what I started at Jill's and then I had to stop because it was time to go. She she was going to go up to the shop. She had some customs to do uh -huh. <clears throat> to work on after hours. So um, I stopped what I was doing, but I could show you guys. Um what they say? Uh, Shorty's just been a... Uh, which he has gotten on Shorty's last nerve and, you know... Uh -oh. <laughs> Shorty's starting to, to light whiskey on fire. Okay, so the one that's pretty much done was the, like, the angel, the fire one that I did that mm -hmm. has all the metallic on it. So that one's pretty much done. That's the big one that had all the, like grunginess I was doing I can't never remember which direction to go the grunginess I was doing last week so that's why we went to do it at Jill's house because she wanted to do some of that and so then I have this one that I started working on it's obviously way not finished but this was just like a I don't know we were just messing around with colors I just took some of the most random colors with me cobalt blue was one of them and then there's this one that I got to finish um this is what I did at Jill's so that's pretty. Isn't it neat? So right. I need to figure out how to give it some more texture and do some more layers on it. But I didn't want to start messing around with sea spray. So I figured I'd just start painting a background on this one for a new one. And this is where we are right now. Obviously, it's wet, but it's very kind of, I don't know what you call it. <laughs> it's drippy and really kind of cool. Yeah. Looking, so I can't wait to see it when it's dry. But it, you know, it's, it's amazing how the colors and everything change yeah. when they dry from when they're wet. And then you go to put oh, a yeah. top coat over them and it kind of like it boom, changes there it, it is. again. Yeah. 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 Brings it out. Yeah, I should. You know, what? I hadn't thought about putting a top coat on some of these to maybe like pull out a little bit more. That would be kind of cool. Especially so, the one with the sea spray. I'm going to turn this around so you guys can see the top. And if you were watching the live, to put the what? Yeah, I, I'll, I'll, I'll get it. It's no big deal. Um, that Shorty and I decided to keep this piece. So everything I'm doing now to it. Oh, yeah. Because I want it. It's mine now. There you go. So, yeah, this piece is mine now. <laughs> Let me see if I can. Can y'all see that? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm trying to. So some gave all. Yeah. All gave some. Cool. Some gave yeah. all. And then I think that's as high as the tripod goes, though, so often. We're trying to work the tripod for you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, gonna be able so everyone was saying, um, you know, yeah. Hmm. And so everyone's saying to Jill, you know, get better. Amber said, saw that one. Angela says she loves it. Gina says she's loving it. Jan is watching. Hey, Jan. Uh, love it, Krista. Thank you, Carrie. 
So um, that's what I'm working on. As you can see, there is some still discoloration uh, because these, this side is still wet. And so it still looks very blue in some areas, but it'll dry this blackened color. And since this is silk and silk already has a uh, top coat in it, and then glaze is also you can use as a top coat. So I won't have to seal this again. And, you know, that's the great thing about being a furniture artist. It's mine. So if I jack it up, I know how to fix it. <laughs> exactly. So it's kind of the nice part of, you know, being a furniture artist is that if I jack it up, I can fix it. And you can so, also play around and do things. Yeah. There might be really cool. Yeah. Yeah. There might be some stuff that later on down the road I want to. Um, that's, that's how I came your about ad and the whole canvas that I did with the angel, um, I actually, um, those of you who saw it, and I know Carrie, you're aware of it, well, you may not be aware that this is what happened, but it started out with the glass that I did that I painted those layers of silk on to kind of show off the silk and how to use it. Cause there were some people struggling in one of the groups and I was just like, okay, let's just show people how to use it. And, um, so I went back and I was originally going to do angel wings on the glass. And that's how it all started. But when I went with my spatula, I had it too wet in the area that I actually nicked it. And stupid me, instead of leaving it alone, mama had to go and like pull the little piece and just like took layers off. So I yeah. scraped the entire glass down. I'll have to go back and redo it. But um, that's what gave so, me the idea to do it on canvas. Yeah. Amanda Lowry said, awesome. Never thought to use glaze on stencils. Glazing oh, stencils yeah. is... I love it. I love layering them. I need um, to do that. I saw your video when you did it on your live a few weeks ago. It was like really cool. those, Yeah, those are the gilding waxes. No, 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 no. You were doing it with the um, one that you and Shorty were working on together. You were using glazes on the top. The um, Oh, yeah, the, yeah, yeah. On the, the uh, French stencil. Yeah, the French That I did on top. Yeah. Yep. You were I was using layering glaze. I used uh, copper bronze glaze and I used you had like a gold uh, didn't you I thought you had gold yeah I used gold, gold shimmer and I used the uh yeah. pearlized I think yeah so I'd never thought about doing the glazes I really haven't worked with glazes I don't typically work with the gla well I lied the first piece I ever did the mermaid's chest I glazed did the gold shimmer on it and it turned out super cool um I kind of forget yeah. about those and the um waxes I love I glazes I do uh especially I need to start using them more yeah, and also the thing, too, is one thing about glazes, especially if you've got a black piece, and, you know, gator hide will streak sometimes right. over top of that, use, use black that glaze. Instead. Use black glaze. Right. Because that's, that's sealed. Because Amber, there you go, because Amber's always asking, how about, like, what do you do over your caviar and stuff? Amber, maybe you need to try to use the glaze. Yeah, um, I mean, if you, uh, if you, uh, if the hemp oil's not going to work, um, hold on just a second. Whiskey. Whiskey. Uh-oh. <laughs> Whiskey. Uh, I think she's doing something she's not supposed to be doing. Come on. Whiskey girl, out. Uh-oh. Out, out. All right. Uh, excuse me, because everybody's going out now. Um, I didn't mean to do a chain <laughs> reaction there. I'm her out. Um, shoo, shoo. <laughs> Right. So <laughs> if uh, if you're going over dark finishes and you don't want it to do that, the, to streak, what you can do is you can use your glaze. Hemp oil works really well over top of caviar. Uh, Big, Big Mama's, Mama's butter works mm -hmm. really well over top of caviar. Um, you know, that's the thing is that there's other alternatives to it. And so you can... Um, you can de use that. Also, um, Amber says she loves this metal. Um, and she says, hey, maybe that is it. Dana Perry says, Chris, Chris, do you have any military memorabilia you can add to your piece since you're keeping it? Maybe make some custom hardware or attach some other way. Um, I'm thinking about putting my, well, this is more of a military army. And, you know, I was Coast Guard, so that's more of a Navy, Naval. Um, so I think what I'm going to do is this piece is going to be mine. 
I'm thinking about putting some of my information on it, but I want to do, I've got in my head, I want to do a pinup girl, like a Navy style pinup girl. You no, you're not going to go get the posters again. And um, I want to do that in a Navy theme, but have pinup girls and I want to do it for shorty. And so I was thinking about adding some more of those. But we do have some folded flags um, that are in cases for yeah, family members. Yeah, like shadow boxes. Can you, can yeah. you add a shadow and box so, with some of your patches and stuff? Yeah, so up on the top is where I'll keep some of my memorabilia. And yes, Carrie, Shorty says that I could keep this. So this is this one's going to be hey, my hey, piece. John. And Betty, is Betty on? I didn't see Betty. Yeah. Yep, okay, just came on. Hey, hey Betty. Yeah. So is. we're actually getting ready to uh, wind up. But there's one more tip I wanted to show you guys because I meant to do it <laughs> Saturday night. And I completely forgot. Uh, it was funny how you're live and it was Shorty showing your pen up. I'm glad you found that funny. Um, but if you ever use the clean as a whistle, what I do is I, I started out when I first got it. I put it in a wide mouth mason jar, but I couldn't get my scarlet inside of the wide mouth and you can only get one or two of your brushes to soak in it so what i did is i went down to uh michael's and i bought one of these glass jars that has a lid okay you like can, a candy dish yeah. and so let me show you let me go throw these in the sink real quick because they've been soaking for two days and so this away what I do is I'm just going to do this, put that on so it doesn't evaporate when I'm not soaking my brushes and it's wide enough I can put seven, eight brushes at a time in there. And then I'm saving it for later use. So to make it go further, last longer, that's what I do. So, uh, So, yep, there is Betty. I see her now. Hey, Betty. Um, so, I'm going to do a, a Navy piece um, here soon, and I'm going to do it for Shorty, and I'm going to get some pinup girls. Can I show the pinups? No, you cannot show my pinups. And so, um, I actually did, like, rockabilly pinup <laughs> photo shoots uh, about, what, eight years ago. And so, yes, he... He loves my pinups, but you know, anyway, um, actually maybe I might share one or two in the, uh, painting with whiskey and women. I've got some of them on my phone. I might share some of those. So Christina, let's go ahead and, um, I see <laughs> she said, yay yeah. for shorty and for your pinup. Uh, Christina, go <laughs> ahead and tell them what you're about girl. Cause we are time to end and wrap up for the evening. Yes. Um, so I am Christina, aka bug. I'm not going to go through the other one. You know what it is. Don't let it leave the screen. <laughs> um, Bridget. Um, <laughs> so, yes, um, I am an elite Dixie Bell retailer. I have a booth at 1427 Rosal Road at the Marriott Antique Mall where you can find all of my Dixie Bell goodness and some of my painted furniture and also have painted furniture um, close to me up in Holly Springs at Holly Market, as well as my signs and that sort of thing. And, um, yeah, and I, I'm going to wait for this to dry tomorrow, and then we'll come back and see. That's what I did, another canvas. So it's looking really cool. And now I'm going to get ready to go get some food. <laughs> That's it. I'm done. Are you? Because I'm not. Why? Are you? <gasps> my board oh wait hold up now wait no stop it okay if i can like get over here without killing myself girl don't make me break out the jill buds <laughs> <laughs> let's see what can we write tonight hmm what do we write <laughs> i'm already immune to linda so you can use that one if you want <laughs> so I I am linda, linda. linda linda listen linda 
So I am Krista with Litter, with Litter Cheap Litter. I am, uh, you can get all of my ooey gooey Dixie no goodness at the Plaza Garland in Week N108. We are open Thursday through Monday, 10 to 5. Um, I also do classes, and that's where I have my customs. And you can buy my custom painted pieces um, inside of the Mesquite Antique Mall in Mesquite, Texas. And uh, we are on Painting with Whiskey and Women every Tuesday. Um, every Saturday in the month of October, I will be on the Dixie Bell main page. Yeah, I see you, girl. And uh, <laughs> oh, down on me. You don't even bother me one bit anymore. So, used to bother me. Now it's like, yeah, whatever. So, uh, that's us. And, you know, it, I think it upsets her more that I'm not letting her get to me. Uh, I, I'm getting her more. I love you too, baby. <laughs> So, Jill, we hope you feel better, and hopefully oh. she will be back on. Next week, we will be doing our Flamingo Challenge, if uh, all three of us are on here. Um, so, I, I don't, we, okay, but now we got to wait for Bugs to it. She's rotten. Yes, give me, yes, two seconds. One, so two, no! Don't count. No! You said two seconds. Yeah, I'm trying. It will, Jill. Yes. So much love, my lovely Christina. Are you going to be back on Dixie Bell Friday night? Oh, yeah. Thank you for that. Yes. I totally forgot because I wasn't on last week. Um, Yes. Friday night, 9 p.m., Dixie Bell main page. We will be um wrapping up or getting close to wrapping up the piece I started two weeks ago. So, yes. And I'll be starting a new piece on Dixie Bell this week, the Saturday night at 8 Eastern. So, hope you guys can join us. Much love. Bye.